you can go as far into the future as you'd like. But you should never forget your roots. We're getting back to the roots of rock. I just want to do a, a little short tribute to a cat by the name of uh, Nehemiah Curtis Skip James. Yeah, but, do it! Better known as Skip James. Uh, born in 1902, he was an American Delta blues singer, guitarist, pianist, and songwriter. And um, I don't know if people are familiar with uh, Bentonia, Mississippi or not, but it's kind of known for having its own genre pretty much, of a style of blues. It's kind of, I don't know, ethereal sounding, a lot of open minor guitar tunings, gloomy themes, um, a lot of songs about the devil. Wow. (laughs) Uh, Actually, Skip James only played for a short time. In 1931, he recorded um, a whole slew of songs. But the Depression was in full swing, and they didn't sell, so he just kind of stopped recording. It wasn't until 1960 when... Uh, kind of the blues revival hit, Cream recorded uh, one of his songs. Wow. And people came knocking and said, hey, man, you know, you think you could uh, start jamming again? So he did. And uh, he was a big influence on Robert Johnson. The song that we're going to play tonight, a tune called Devil Got My Woman, uh, was a huge influence on Robert Johnson and some of the... uh, I think it's uh, Hellhound on My Trail by Robert Johnson that this influence, and a couple others. So tonight, we're playing tribute to Skip James on the Church of Rock and KSKQ. You've enlightened all of us. Thank you, Sister Tracy. <laughs> Thank you. 
two hours of shite on a Sunday night. You're listening to the Church of Rock on KSKQ.